Good morning. Hey! <laughs> Noelle and I are about to go to the gym. Um, she's about to make breakfast. I'm about to have some of my probiotic yogurt I've been obsessed with and fill up my water. Um, we've had a crazy past two days with some drama in the house. Okay, so basically, someone that we've been working with for like a really long time, like we considered the family, like been working with them for years, um, had a, like a key to my house, like all of that. Basically, we have like pet cameras in our house and we uh, went back to like just watch some of the footage on the pet camera, like not expecting to see anything. And we saw this person with this other person that they brought like conspiring to steal my stuff. So we're like watching these videos and they're like holding up like my skim underwear and they're like, you think this will fit? And they're like, I'm just watching them take all this stuff and I'm like high and I'm like mind blown. So I'm like watching or like airplane it on the TV and I'm staring and I'm just like, is this real? Like what's going on? So we've been trying to figure that out for the past like two days. It's been stressful, but yeah, I think it's mostly figured out at this point. Um, but yeah, <laughs> so that's been crazy. We're about to go to the gym. I'll show you the yogurt that I've been eating. So I heard about this company for a while, and every time I go to their website, they're always sold out, like of every single flavor. I found this on Postmates somehow, and it's just the the normal like coconut probiotic flavor. But they have a banana bread one that looks fucking insane. And it was like only, they only had it once, like until they sold out. And I don't think they make it anymore. And I DM them, I'm like, please, how do I buy it? And they just won't answer me. So that sucks. Yeah, it honestly tastes really good. It has like a slight hint of coconut. And you're supposed to take a tablespoon or two every morning. It's awesome. It has 16 probiotics in it. What do you eat in the morning, Noelia? Oh, I call this the Dean Special. The Dean Special. <laughs> um, it's two breakfast sausages, two scrambled eggs, and a protein waffle. Love it. Lots of protein. Yeah, it looks like. I've been touring houses for the past, like, literally two years at this point. Um, but yeah, so basically, we've been touring houses for the past two ish years trying to find somewhere to move to we've lived in this apartment for um, three years i think it's like three years and a month and it's like great it's a really nice apartment i didn't expect to like buy property at like this age <laughs> so it's really nice and i'm happy but it gets no fucking sunlight and like i know me as a person and i need like so much sun and everything to be bright natural light to be happy so i've just been kind of sad <laughs> living here but i've been trying to find somewhere and it's been so fucking hard everywhere we like see is like almost cute enough and like it just like doesn't have enough closet space for me or like it's really old and we just can't find anywhere and we saw a place last week that we finally really really liked so i sent in an application i'm waiting hopefully i'll hear back this week and I really, 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 really want to move there. So hopefully that works out. I'm really excited if it does. And it's going to be so fun getting new furniture and getting stuff to decorate. I'm so excited. But yeah, wish us luck with that. Noelia hit her car into something and it's taking a month to get fixed because they have to replace the whole door. So she's been driving my car, which is great since I obviously can't drive it. So that's been fun. Any other updates? <laughs> yeah, I think that's it as of now. Coachella's in a few weeks. Ready? I just said Coachella! Yeah, Coachella's in a few weeks. We're excited, but I'm nervous. I'm trying to get my outfits ready. I'm trying to like be cute, comfy. Like I think I'm gonna wear like long skirts with like a tank top. So we'll see. I'll show you guys when I'm making my outfits for that. But yeah, that's it as of now. I'm gonna go to the gym. Oh, we both were like kind of feeling sick the past few days, but we feel better. So hopefully at the gym, it doesn't like come back and we like start dying. Yeah. I just finished a workout um, with Ilya at David's and I'm going to get my hair dyed. And I know I just changed my hair like two weeks ago, but I'm bored already. So I'm going to dye it like a dark red, which I've never done before. Sorry, I'm ordering my Uber. That's what I'm like. I'm dyeing it like a darker red since I've always done orange and I haven't done red yet. And then 
I'm cutting it into a bob, which I'm excited about. And it's actually funny because I feel like every year around this time, I cut my hair into a bob and dye it. Like last year, this exact time, it was a platinum blonde bob. So it'll be fun. I'm nervous, but I'm excited. I also love having a bob at Coachella because I like And it's fun to like whip my hair out. But yeah, so I'll update after it's done or during the process. Okay, I just made breakfast. I copied Noelia, she makes this every morning basically. I made eggs and I just put tomatoes, avocado and sausage and I put some green salsa on the eggs. Yeah, I just did a little at home workout. I did the Alexis Ren ab video and then the Daisy Keach bubble butt workout. And honestly, my glutes were on fire, so that was awesome. I didn't have enough time to go to the gym this morning because I'm about to go to Universal with Noelia and Zane and they just opened the Mario Kart part of it, so I'm really excited for that. I'm so sad. <laughs> I'm so sad because the house that I said I liked accepted someone else's application instead of mine, and it's really weird, and I'm really sad about it, and I don't understand why, and it's the first house I've liked in like two years. I was gonna say it wasn't meant to be, and hopefully something else comes up that I end up liking more, but I was literally already planning out like what furniture I was gonna get and like, everything I was gonna do in that house, but things happen, so it's fine. I'm so sad, I hope I find a house that I like. Literally, I go on Zillow every single day, and there's just like nothing, and houses are so fucking expensive right now for no reason, like it makes no sense to me. This weekend is Sydney's birthday. We are doing high tea at the peninsula, and we're gonna dress up super fancy, like maybe do some like hats or like cool hairstyles, and just sip tea, which will be cute. She was gonna have a party, but then we were all like, probably shouldn't do that because Coachella's the weekend after. No one probably wants to go out right now. So we're doing the restaurant Benihana where they like cook in front of you and they like do like the meats and the rice and stuff. We're gonna do that at Devin's house in her backyard and set it up really cute. And I think she's gonna get it like a Mexican snack cart thing. So we have like the mango with the teen, the chips, fun stuff like that. It's gonna be awesome. And I'm excited that we're just staying in and doing that. It's more our vibe oh my hair um <laughs> yeah my hair it's red obviously it's really short it's a bob it's back right now so you can't really tell i like it i like this hair length on me i've had it before it's from it's like a change though obviously from the extensions so i kind of feel bald and i don't really know how to like do my hair or what to do with it and someone commented on my tiktok saying i look like chucky so now i'm insecure about that and i really do think i look like chucky so i'm like do i keep the red since it's different i've never done it before and just be like i feel like it's more like edgy high fashion type vibe or do i say fuck it and just dye it brown but when i dye it brown i won't be able to go back from that so like that's my final option so let me know what you think i should do because i honestly like i don't know um okay i'm gonna finish eating and then i'm gonna go get ready to go to universal with zane and amelia From that footage, we ended up going to Six Flags instead of Universal. Zane didn't get tickets in advance, so it ended up being fully sold out. So we went there, went on a few rides, walked around, it was fun. Now I'm back home, but it was so much walking and I'm like exhausted from it. Oh, also I didn't eat there at all, so I just ordered so much sushi, which I I should just never be able to order food when I'm already hungry. It's just me eating. I think I ordered 10 things. I'm probably gonna eat it all too. And now I'm going to watch Severance, which I started like a really long time ago and I forgot about it and I just restarted it and it's really, really good. It's like kind of weird vibes and confusing, but I think it's all gonna come together at the end. I think I have a whole- ah! <laughs> Okay, it's time to go. I haven't opened my packages in like a week and <laughs> there's like a lot to open. Oh, headband. 
I had a morning where I went on Amazon and I just ordered a bunch of Hello Kitty stuff. I don't know why, but that's one of the things I ordered. We got these for Coachella from The Real Real. Let's see. I got this Prada skirt that I thought could be cute with like a belt. Um, I don't know how to say the name of this brand. It says Caso Ruiz or something. I'm not sure, but it's like long, has some lace detailing. You can't really see here. Long, cute. I think this is Sydney's birthday present. She sent this sweater in our group chat the other day with like a sad face because she wanted it. So I was like, this is the perfect opportunity to buy it for her birthday. It's like a Rick Owens cropped black sweater. I think this is more Coachella stuff. Okay, I got these Dior riding boots. I thought they would be cute. And then I got these boots. These are Gucci. They're a little bit taller and they're brown. I need to like test wear these before Coachella to make sure they're comfortable and I don't get like blisters or anything. This company called by Gianna. Is that me this top? Really cute. These pants. Honestly, I can wear these to Coachella. Okay. <laughs> Some underwear. Why not? Oh, and then matching sports bras. This is from Me Undies, and honestly, like, their shit's really comfortable. I can't lie. I found or discovered this olive oil at Devin's house. It's really awesome. It's called Grazza, and I love this olive oil. I love the packaging. This is dog stuff from SGT Puffa. Collar. Aww. No way. It's a hot dog hoodie. <gasps> I've been waiting for this one. This is from Susan Alexandra. She sent me this cute little beaded purse. Look how adorable this is. It's so cute with this little chili hanging off. I'm obsessed. Cute little necklace. Let's see. Okay, we're almost done. Kind of. I didn't mean to order this. I meant to order one. I do this all the fucking time. I meant to order one big bag of chips and I ordered a million of them. I always do this. I did that with pasta too, and now I have like 200 bags up there. This is crazy. I got pink heart straws on Amazon. A posture adjuster for my bag. A cake tinsel thing to make cakes that are Hello Kitty. Okay, I think that's all my packages for now. Now I have to go organize all of them. Welcome. To IT! Oh my god, wait. That's insane. I have a cold, so I just ordered so many shots, like wellness shots. Shit. It's all about. That was an immunity shot, and I want to drink a vitamin C one. I have a few more in the fridge, but I feel like I should only take those now because I feel like if I take a lot, that's not good for me. <laughs> I'm debating what to order for dinner. I've been trying to eat healthy, but since I'm sick, I just want comfort food. <laughs> so I probably will cheat on my healthiness tonight. I already ordered carrot cake, so that's my appetizer for my meal later. So we'll see what I end up ordering. I just got back from Coachella yesterday. My voice is kind of gone, if you can't tell, and my hair is still in my braids from three days ago. And basically I'm a mess. Not actually, but I'm recovering for sure. This is the first day I feel normal, I would say. And I have to start packing because I leave town again tomorrow, which is absolutely insane. Like, I did not plan this out well when I booked this flight. I'm going to London with Olivia. I'm really excited. 
I haven't been in like forever and I really miss it. So I think it'll be good and I'll be feeling better when I get there. But it would have been nice to have some time to rest in between. Um, but yeah, Coachella was, it was fun. I had a lot more fun last year, I would say. I just feel like there were more artists performing last year that I was excited about seeing. And this year, for some reason, I was way more hungover than last year. I think maybe it's just because I'm getting old, I guess, which is really unfortunate. <laughs> Frank's set was interesting. I don't really have much to say about Coachella, but I had fun. I love seeing my friends running around having fun. And I really can't believe I'm about to get on a plane. I'm really stressed, I can't lie. <laughs> just wanted to recap. Say I'm going to London. I'll vlog when I'm there. My brain isn't working, so I'm gonna go try and take a 30 minute nap before I start packing. <laughs>